With violence spreading in the valley, one city is taking a proactive step to keep kids safe. Call it Holyoke's anti-house party. CBS 3 Springfield's Matthew Campbell has a story from Holyoke. They've seen the heartbreak, and they know the victims. A lot of people here know of the death of John John and a lot of other people. And they know they need a change. I'd rather people be in here than be on the streets and getting shot. Because we don't need none of that. After violence that ended in murder broke out at a house party, the youth in Holyoke searched for other options. House parties aren't the best, but this is really good for them because it brings another place for them to go to. And with no parents in sight, they found their outlet here at Holyoke High. Basketball tournaments go on in the gym and girls make crafts in another room. Call it the anti-house party. Teams from Holyoke meet monthly, spending their night off the street and in a safe but fun environment. I go straight to the source and I get young people who are enthusiastic about providing stuff that's fun for their, their um, peers. These nights are sponsored by the Holyoke Youth Task Force, but the events are all planned by the kids. Lee Eaton and Cassidy Melendez are coordinating the event, and they say the turnout is so high because these are the kids who've seen the other side, and they want to stay on the right path. And these here, they're going to really dangerous areas where there's guns and like gangs and stuff. So when they leave here, it's like going back to the river. But when there's cops here, there's going to be a lot of supervision, and they know they'll be protected. From Holyoke, Matthew Campbell, CBS 3 Springfield.